Okay, guys, so quick update on Luna. As you can see, strong bounce right here from this big support area from the past price action around $54, guys. If you take a look at the past price action, you can see that we bounced already a couple of times from this area around 54 bucks, guys. And as you can see right now, Luna is definitely able to recover quite well if you're comparing especially Luna right now with BTC. You can see right here in the 4-hour candles, guys, that Luna still holding very strong right here like i said the support around 54 to about 55 dollars i think if bitcoin is going down right now to about 30 thousand dollars or so it could definitely also influence luna at this point i think if luna is breaking below this support around 55 dollars and we are closing i would say one or two four hour candles somewhere between 55 to about 51 dollars i would say luna can definitely drop to about i would say 45 percent from here to about 33 dollars guys this would be i would say the biggest support out of all supports right here for luna around 33 dollars guys and this would be actually a sell-off of about 67 percent from the top guys even if you take a look for example on sandbox and decentraland and so um also very strong uh, fundamental very strong coins guys but they are also dropping um, a lot of, uh, right now about 65 percent is for example on sandbox guys and that's why i think it could also definitely happen to luna otherwise if bitcoin is going for another bounce from this area around thirty-five thousand dollars and we are able to hold up right here luna can definitely maybe uh, do a huge bounce in the next um, big resistance area for luna would be in my opinion around 70 dollars right here guys at this point so um just make sure to take a look at this support right here and this resistance right here on $70. I think the problem right now on Luna, guys, that a lot of people been buying the dip somewhere between $70 to about $87 right here in this range. We have a lot of backholders sitting right now. And that's why make sure if you are reaching this area on $70, $72 right here, maybe to take out some profits if you've been buying Luna on this dip right here um, around, uh, let's say, $54. So the thing is we could definitely see maybe some strong price action for Luna over the next couple of weeks maybe. It will also decouple from Bitcoin guys and if so I think we have to reclaim like I said first of all this resistance around $70 and then maybe we can see another huge run up for new all time highs around $100, $110, $120. For now, I'm just taking a look at this price action at this support area around $55 guys. If we are still able to hold up right here this support um, over the next i would say one or two days i'm definitely expecting a bounce like i said already to about 70 dollars otherwise if we are breaking below the support we can definitely go down to about 33 between 33 to about 40 dollars again for luna guys so overall in the weekly time frame let's take a look real quick at the weekly guys you can see in my opinion in the weekly time frame we are still holding up quite well at this point we are still trading in the weekly time frame in a very strong uptrend in my opinion guys and if you're comparing luna like i said already with bitcoin over the last couple of months you can see that if you would for example um sell bitcoin at the top around 69k and just put all your money into luna around 25 to 35 bucks right here you would make a profit of let's say an average definitely around 100 to about 200 percent guys and yeah i'm definitely bullish on luna and i think there is definitely also a possibility if bitcoin is able to recover that luna will recover even stronger than bitcoin and we are going for new all-time highs like i said to about 110 or 120 dollars guys